Hi everyone! So today I have a really exciting video for you. I have a what's in my purse video and I personally absolutely love watching what's in my purse videos. They're so interesting to watch and everyone keeps something different in their purse and they're just really interesting to watch and I love watching them. So today I'm making one because guess who got a new purse? This girl! Finally! I've had... Um, I will try to link my... Um, I won't try to link. I will link my um, previous What's In My Purse down below. I did it like over a year ago. It was a long time ago. And I had my little coach one. My little, like, little, little one. Oh, by the way, my hand says I Heart Kentucky Summer 2012 because I just came back from Kentucky and I had the time of my life. Anyways, so um, I had a little coach one and um, if you are interested to see that, go click on it down there. But anyway, so while I was in Kentucky, um, I was in Target and we were going to buy like a board game because I went there with my youth group. Um, people, yeah, we were going to go buy a board game and we passed by the purses in Target and me and one of my really good friends, Rachel, we decided to both buy this purse because why not? We wanted matching purses and so I will show you guys this is what it looks like, isn't it so cute? So it has like a shoulder strap, just like that. So you can wear it like on your shoulder like this or crossbody. I wear it both ways, really. I don't, I don't know. So this is what it looks like. It's like this um, brown caramel color. Um, it has really pretty like this detailing. No, it looks like that. It's like an envelope purse, but it has a lot of fringe. And I feel like even though it's kind of like, it's very like trendy because of the fringe, I feel like it's also kind of classic looking because of the shape and the color. And it's a perfect size. My coach one was a little bit smaller than this. It was like about three fourths the size. And I wanted something with a little bit more space because I don't know. But anyways, I love it so much and it was in Target. It was at Target. I bought it at Target for $25, which is a steal. So go get this purse if you're looking for a nice new purse. But it has like a a button clasp and it has a big pocket like that and it has a little pocket. So I'm going to show you guys what's in the little pocket and something weird about me, I guess, is that I don't have a wallet. It's kind of weird, right? So, um, in that little pocket, I have 30 bucks because I don't have a wallet. And I also have some quarters and coins. I bet you guys can hear that. And also some bobby pins and stuff. So that's all that's in there. And then I will go through everything else that's in the big pocket right now. The first thing in here is a brochure from church yesterday. That's not very exciting, but it's just a brochure. It tells us what we're doing every day and it has announcements and stuff. It's just a brochure. And then in here also I have um, a worksheet that I took notes on for Sunday school. And then I also have a note card that I'm supposed to I'm supposed to do something with this note card so that's a secret. It's only if you go to my church then you know what that is. Okay so let's get into the fun things. The first off I have Razzles! Isn't that amazing? Okay, I, while I was in Kentucky, I no, I think I was in Illinois, when um, we went to Cracker Barrel and we had breakfast there, and it was like an old country store, and they had Razzles. If you've ever seen the movie 13 Going to 30, you know like how big a deal Razzles is in that movie. And also, I've had this before. I got it um, when I was trick-or-treating. I, I got some something like that. But I haven't finished it all, but it's Razzles, and it's amazing. It's candy and it's gum, and I love it. So that's that. And then I have a notebook, just a pink notebook. Well, I was in Kentucky. We went to this museum, and we had to take notes in the museum. So I just have several notes in there. And then I also have my sunglasses, which you guys have seen before. These are like um, a Wayfarer, Wayfarer? I don't know how to say that word, but it's like that kind of style. And it's turquoise, it matches my room, and this is what it looks like on me. I quite like it a lot, and it's like a mirror, so you can't see my eyes through it. So I really like these glasses. I got them at JCPenney's for a really good deal, so I got that. And then I also have a ton of gum in here. I'll try to scope it out. Um, here I have some Stride Sean White gum, which is really good. All the gum in my purse is mint because the only gum I like is mint. 
So I have Sean White gum. I have Wrigley's Winter Fresh gum. I'm sorry, that's my brother screaming if you can hear that. This is um, the five gum in the rain. This is my favorite kind of gum. And I think, no, I have one more. I have another stride one. This is Sweet Peppermint. So quite the gum girl, aren't I? But anyway, I love gum. If you are ever with me, you know I'm the person to ask if I have gum because I always do. And then in here I also have my Blackberry, which is my phone. I'm getting a new phone hopefully in two months and I'm so excited. I've had this for almost two years, so I'm still a Blackberry user. Um, I also have a hotel key because um, I stayed at a hotel while I was in Kentucky and I didn't throw this away yet because it's like a memorabilia, so I have a hotel key. And then I, and there's like these two little pockets on the side. I'm not done with like everything else in the big pockets, but I also have in those two side pockets. I just have like, I have bu some business cards and I also have some like tickets and some, a few notes, just things that I like to keep and that, things I like to like look back on and just read and I think it's really fun to do. And back to the big pocket, I have an Utterly Smooth Utter Cream hand thing, hand cream. It's called Utter Cream, which is hilarious. I bought this while I was in Wisconsin a while ago. Um, actually, no, that, that's a lie. Like, two weeks ago. Um, my legs were just super dry, so I got this, and I thought it was... I don't know, I heard good things about it, so... And I thought it was interesting, because it's like Utter Cream, even though it's like hand cream. I have that, and then I have a little Kleenex pack with only one Kleenex left in it. Uh-oh, I have to get a new one. And then I also have a Chewy Dips granola bar that is all squished and nasty. But just in case I get hungry and there's no like vending machines or food around, I can eat this. Woo-woo! There's everything, like, my whole vicinity right now is like a mess because of everything that's in my purse. And then I also have my curling eye... curling eye... the eyelash curler. This is from e.l.f. and I love it. So I have that. And then in here I have, this is a piece of paper, this is my ticket to Kings Island. If you guys don't know what Kings Island is, it's um, it's like a like an amusement park and it was, I believe it was in Kentucky, it was really fun. So that's my ticket. And then I have um, a pink mechanical pencil and a black pen that is almost out. I know this because I tried to take notes on it and it didn't work. Um, and then I have this black and purple rubbery snake because while I was in Kings Island we played some arcade games and you get like those tickets and I only got like five tickets and this is the only thing I could get and I don't know it's whatever and then I have a sharpie which I use to write on my hand and just it's quite a handy thing I have an EOS lip balm in a honeysuckle which is my favorite one I have a Altoid Smalls box, which is kind of deceiving because, okay, it has Altoids in it. I don't know if I can show you guys this. So these are the Altoids. They're like the squares with an A's. But I actually also have pills in here. <laughs> Just like an easier way to store them. The circle ones are my pills for motion sickness because I get car sick really easily. So I keep that there. And then I have a peppermint. And then this is really interesting. I have a sucker, a strawberry flavored sucker with a cricket inside. I got this also at the museum. Um, my friend bought it for me and there's like a cricket in there. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's a legit cricket in there and I haven't eaten it yet because I just haven't felt like it yet. But anyways, I'm excited to eat it. I'm pretty sure like, I don't know. I've eaten a cricket before. Like, psh, it's a normal thing. And then I have like two more things in here. I have a little hand sanitizer. Just a little baby one. I It's just like the ones that stink, not like a fancy Bath and Body Works one. And then the last product in here is my Revlon um, Berry Smoothie Lip Butter, which I'm wearing today. And I really like it when I'm just, when I just want to pop in my face and it's really pretty. Let me open it up for y'all. That's what it looks like. So that is it for my what's in my purse. My purse is currently, um empty right now but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys like my new purse I do think I, I should name my new purse I just don't know what to name it yet but anyways I hope you guys enjoy this I will be doing a back to school series hopefully soon maybe not completely a series but I want to do a school supplies haul for sure and also um, a clothing haul so I hope you guys enjoy this and I will see you guys later bye guys